one, go! Action on the field, scoring first, team number 27 for the Blue Alliance. Red Alliance comes roaring back, 23-39, 40-99, and 1987, all, all participating in the scoring drive. Red Alliance has a lead, 30 to 22 at the end of the autonomous period. Teleoperated period now underway. Shooting long range, deep inside Blue Alliance territory. Team number 1987, the Bronco Bots, giving their mystery machine a workout. Coming right back at it for the Blue Alliance. Team number 4028, the Beak Squad. Supporting their efforts, their alliance partner, team number 27, Team Rush. And the Beak Squad add two more pieces of cargo. And in the meantime, it's team number 33 for the Blue Alliance working on defense. 40-99, picking a fight with the Bees. That'll be the Falcons chasing them down and cornering them. Deep inside red territory before backing off. Blue Alliance combining to score four pieces of blue cargo in the upper hub. Blue Alliance with the lead now, 78 to 70, looking to extend it. Red Alliance trying to narrow the gap. Ten point difference at this point. It's still too close to call with 35 seconds remaining. Watching the bees on the far side of the field. 1987, the defender taking them on. Bronco Bonds shoving them against the guardrail, keeping them out of scoring position. Blue Alliance with two robots climbing. Red Alliance just does the same. 4099, reaching back and grappling onto the traversal rung. Trying to release now from the high rung. Can they do it? Blue Alliance has two traversal rung climbers. Time has expired. Red Alliance was trying to put on a show. Blue Alliance was strong in the closing seconds. Was it enough to carry the match? Let's find out. Your winner is the Blue Alliance. Blue Alliance was all business in the closing seconds, earning 134 total points during that qualifying match. Four ranking points to each member of the Blue Alliance. Coming up next, qualifying.